Hey guys, amazingly, I'm not doing anything again today. Um, I also haven't gotten on Tumblr today. I set up like a queue so stuff would post, but I haven't gotten on. But, um, apparently the One Direction storyboard interview was posted today, and if you're not a One Direction fan and don't know about that interview, um, I won't explain it because you probably don't care, and it's kind of hard to explain. I don't really know how to explain it. But I think a lot of One Direction fans were dreading that interview because of some of the stuff that might that they might have asked the boys about in the interview. And um, I, like I said, I haven't been on Tumblr all day, so I don't know how, what people's reactions are to the interview. Um, but I have seen someone posted on Twitter that it was up now, and they refer to it as being rude. And I don't really know how exactly it's rude. But I don't know if I want to read it or not, because if it is, like, I don't want to read it if it's going to put me in a bad mood. Like, if they really did ask them about the stuff that everyone was scared they were going to ask them about. So, maybe I'll, I'll probably end up reading it before the end of the day, but I'm going to try and put that off for a little bit, because I don't want to be in a bad mood or something. It might not even be that bad, because, like I said, I don't really know, and... I'm not on Tumblr to see everyone talking about it. But the Cora panel is actually happening at San Diego Comic Con right now, so I'm following a live blog of that on Hypable and to know like what's going on. And some people I'm following are tweeting about it too. And so that's awesome. It seems like a ton of fun. There are apparently like over 4,000 people in the panel room, which is amazing. And they're doing like a live reading, like they have the voice actors there and they have the voice actors like actually doing the voices for a scene there and that just sounds awesome and I wish, I, I want to go to Comic Con so badly but I don't think it'll like ever happen because they sell out so quickly and it's so much money and it's all the way in California but I, I bet if I ever get to go it'll be a year when like none of my like big fandoms have panels. Like the Breaking Dawn panel was yesterday which I'm not like a huge Twilight fan as much as I used to be but I'd still want to go to that panel and the core panels um, today, like right now. But, and I don't think there's a Hunger Games panel, but there's a Hunger Games booth. But I just want to go to Comic Con. But I'm following all the Korra stuff. I followed a live blog of the Breaking Dawn panel yesterday. I'm doing the same thing with Korra today, and it's awesome. Hopefully, there will be some clips up later of the panel. Um, apparently, they showed part of Breaking Dawn at the Breaking Dawn panel. Um, I don't know if it's online anywhere, I haven't seen it, I don't know if I'd even watch it if it was, because it'd be like low quality and stuff. But that's exciting, that's basically most of my day. I'm reading Harry Potter fanfiction in between watching the Korra live vlog. So I like read, and then I go check what's happening with Korra, and then I go read some more. And that's pretty much all I've done today, and almost pretty much the only thing I expect to do today, really, read. Um, yeah. Nothing exciting is happening. My mom went shopping. I could have gone with her, but I really did. I, I sh closed shopping with my mom is not fun. So I'm just here doing nothing again. So I think I will see you guys later. Bye.